Hey y'all, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Jada Simone and you're watching Jada's channel. First off guys, let me start off by thanking you guys so, so much for 1K subscribers. We finally hit 1K. I think right now we're at 1,045 subscribers. So literally my channel hit 1K last week and it's already Monday and we're already, we're already at 45 plus 1K. So it's lit, it's only up from here. I'm so happy so super excited to see where my channel is going to go and i'm so excited to see my growth on youtube like literally with each and every video i see my quality getting better my thumbnails getting better me speaking getting better like i don't know sometimes like i feel like i have trouble speaking expressing myself but me you know setting up my camera getting cute and sitting in front of it i'm getting more comfortable doing public speaking even though I'm not physically in front of an audience. You guys are my audience, so you guys are helping me with that. But um, yeah, so I noticed that you guys really do love the luxury aspect of my channel. So I decided to come at you guys with a collective luxury haul of all the things that I purchased in the month of March. And I'm super excited to share with you guys my purchases. I know you guys, if you clicked on this, you're interested in seeing or like, you know, the luxury side of my life. And I decided to basically formulate my channel from just lifestyle, beauty and fashion to um luxury lifestyle and fashion we're gonna do still do a little bit of beauty y'all know i'm not really a makeup guru but a little bit of beauty here and there but definitely lots of luxury you guys know i'm very 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 big on the luxury black girls deserve luxury as well so we're gonna get our luxury on on this channel so without further ado let's just hop right on into the video okay guys so the first thing i want to show you guys are these alexander mcqueens that i picked up. so guys i'm super excited this was probably the most expensive thing that i purchased in this haul but i was super excited for these i got these um a little below retail um because i got a little plug but so yeah got them a little below retail when i tell you guys i've been wanting some mcqueens for the longest probably since like last summer because i feel like they're the perfect like spring summer shoe especially the all white ones i do want a pair of all black ones when winter rolls back around but i didn't know which pair i wanted to get like they're all freaking cute to me but i just didn't know which pair i wanted to get until i saw these and when i show you guys if you know me you know that this shoe is so me like oh, i love this shoe so much guys this is just how she looks so she's you know all white she has the oversized bottom but she got cheetah print going on my girl said she did not come to play with y'all she didn't come to play with y'all this shoe is so freaking nice like i don't know say what you want about alexander mcqueen's y'all can say that they are just you know a super expensive version of stan smith's but i just feel like they're very good quality this shoe has a lot of weight to it <laughs> and it's just like very nice i love the craftsmanship and i love the fact that it's literally the perfect spring summer shoe like i am in love with this shoe so yeah so yeah i'm very much in love with this shoe you guys know i love me some cheetah print cheetah print i literally just love cheetah print i don't know i feel like cheetah print is just a staple like i might y'all might think i'm a little old lady because i love cheetah print but no cheetah print is a staple just like how like black white gray nude are like staple colors throw in cheetah print cheetah print is a staple color for me i literally have everything i have like i probably have something in cheetah print as well you know how like everybody gets like they have their favorite shirt or pants or something and they get it all in you know the same colors i do that and i always have to get a cheetah print so really love these shoes um i got these in a 37 and a half i'm originally a seven and a half so um translated into the italian sizes I, i'm a 37 and a half so i tried them all already i actually asked one of my friends because i knew like she had a pair so i was like you know should i size up should i size down and you know i did my research everybody said they're true to size um she did say that they were a little snug and you know they do take a little bit to break into or whatever so that's why i got the 37 and a half my true size so yeah this is the first thing i picked up 
the next two items that I picked up are going to be shoes as well and they are from good old Tori Birch. I decided to get these shoes because it's spring now and summer is right around the corner and you know I'm going on a couple trips so I needed some really cute high-end sandals not high-end sandals I won't even say that but you know just some really cute sandals to wear because you know we gotta we gotta be cute on them when we on vacation so yeah the first pair i actually picked up is in this gray color but to be honest it says great on the box but it gives me like a clear nude like i don't know it gives me nude but of course the shoe is clear so a clear nude um i just felt like this would be perfect to wear with like my more brown and nudes type of fits compared to like the all black pair that I also did pick up I just really love these I got these in a size 7 because they don't do half sizes and they said to size down if you're a half size so I'm a seven and a half I got a seven and these fit perfectly usually when I um so I have to size down it usually fits perfectly anyway but yeah I picked these up from Nordstrom and I'm just so in love with them I cannot wait to wear these and style these and I don't know I just feel like these are like the perfect um summer spring shoe also I have always been obsessed with like the jelly type of sandals even when I was younger like I used to always like only want the jelly sandals I didn't want the regular sandals I wanted the jelly ones because I just I don't know they're just so freaking cute so this is bringing me back to like my childhood with the jellies so yeah I prefer to get these over the leather ones and here is the other pair of Tory Burch sandals I got um, the other pair is just in the color perfect black they're jelly as well and I wore these today I just put them back in the box <laughs> but yeah I wore these today and I love them they just have you know they're all black with the gold hardware and I got these in a size 7 as well as um, the nude ones but yeah I really love these I feel like these will definitely be my everyday sandals for when the summertime comes because I'm usually a slide type of girl but I'm growing up and my style is definitely changing like you ever like started wearing something and like you know that was your vibe and then you get you know as time progresses slash is not my vibe no more like I like very much grown sexy girly and I feel like she gives that this is like the perfect dainty sandal especially for vacation like these will definitely be packed in my suitcase so the next thing i picked up is um also tory birch but it is not a shoe it is just a fragrance and, and it's a rollerball i picked this up because i will be going on vacations like i said and um y'all know who is bringing their big perfumes even though you can bring liquids up to 3.4 ounces and usually the big bottle of of perfumes is 3.4 or 3.3 who is breaking the expensive perfumes not me so we got cute little rollerball and it is in the scent bell azure and y'all this smells really good mm. so tanasia actually picked this up for me and i was like mm, i don't know if you should get it i don't know but then i looked up the notes and the top note was bergamot and y'all know i love me some bergamot so definitely like when you smell it it reminds you of a beach like you just think paradise like ocean sea like ugh, it just smells like vacation so super glad i picked this up okay guys so the next thing i picked up is another fragrance and y'all <laughs> y'all this is my new favorite like um decadence and um, what is it? My Burberry blush. Those are my favorites, but nah, she's my new favorite. Like, step aside, because we have a new chef in town, and her name is Princess by Killian. Y'all, I'm obsessed with this perfume. Oh my gosh. So, I ordered this because Auntie Jackie, shout out to Auntie Jackie, she posted a reel with this, and then, like, you know, following the reel, everybody was talking about that it was discontinued, it will no longer be sold, and it, it will be discontinued in the U.S. It'll only be sold in russia which is a shame so i just knew i had to get my hands on it um and i just knew like i would like this i don't know why probably because of the marshmallow in it because um the notes are nothing that i've had before but i just knew the marshmallow was going to sell me on this scent and it definitely did i'm so in love with this scent y'all like <laughs> It just smells so freaking good and I actually um since I'm going on vacation 
I have like a little travel size perfume container and I sprayed this into that so that I can have this because guys this is just the, the perfect scent like I don't I don't know but on the bottom around the entire bottle it just says I don't need a prince by my side to be a princess and that's facts sis you a princess regardless but yes guys I'm so super happy and I got the 3.4 ounce yes i got the 3.4 ounce because i knew that if i could never get my hands on this ever again i needed the biggest one i needed the biggest chanel bag in the store because who's playing so yes i'm super satisfied with this purchase so the next thing is my tan mini telfar bag and i haven't actually worn her yet but I, she she's gonna be getting worn y'all see the tag is definitely still on her but i I'm super happy I got this. I actually filmed a video on me unboxing this. So if you guys would like to see that, don't forget to subscribe and click the bell for post notifications so you guys are notified when I upload this video because it will be uploaded. But yes, I'm obsessed with this bag. I don't really have, okay, I have a brown bag, but it's my Louis. But I needed a very simple everyday brown bag and I feel like this is just so perfect. I originally wanted the chocolate, but I feel like the tan, she's, she's still that girl she gives milk chocolate and you know the brown was given dark chocolate and you know hopefully i do get the brown eventually one day but she's still my girl so we got her and the last things i picked up are actually jewelry so i picked them up from this instagram boutique called um official collection i'll link them in the description box below so you guys can you know directly go to the instagram and i'm also going to link everything else i got um in the description box so you guys can directly go to the links and check out what i got and see if you want to get it as well but yes so this is just the packaging and i have the jewelry on right now so i got these two necklaces and i got these three bracelets but um this is just how they came in the packaging i was super impressed with this company um you know it was my first time ordering from them because i you know i never ordered from them before i never had even heard about them until tanasia put me on so shout out to you sis but they definitely impressed me the shipping was very quick i think i got my stuff in like a week and I really like these little boxes that all the stuff came in and all of the pieces actually do come in their own individual ziploc bag which I felt like was a very nice touch because some companies they don't they packaging don't be up to par like this company definitely definitely impressed me i definitely will be purchasing from them again like i said i got three bracelets so two of them are these roman numeral bracelets one has like a little cubic zirconian little rhinestone um in it like you know a whole bunch of them all around and then the other one is just you know the roman numerals and they're a bit bigger and spaced out and then i got a tennis bracelet and it is a whole bunch of the cubic zirconium jewels set in um gold because i feel like gold really like pops on my complexion so yep those are my three bracelets and then i got two necklaces so i got like a herringbone type um choker and then i got like a gold rope type choker and i felt like these two would be perfect to layer and i'm absolutely loving them like they're freaking cute so yeah like i said i'm definitely linking these below so i could put y'all on and yeah honestly luxury doesn't always have to mean expensive bags and shoes and clothes like you guys see with my jewelry and stuff my jewelry is costume jewelry but i just feel like luxury is anything you know that you decide to treat yourself with luxury could even be just taking yourself out to dinner your favorite lunch something like that just treating yourself pampering yourself luxury could be doing a face mask at the end of the night doing a bubble bath at the end of like a very stressful work day luxury is all on how you define it i define luxury honestly as all the above you know i like my shoes and my bags but i also like you know the luxury of being able to pamper myself and make myself feel special and beautiful and all that jazz okay guys so that is all for today's video i hope you guys like it don't forget to give me a like a comment and subscribe to your girl's channel if you guys love all things luxury like I do, don't forget to click the bell for post notifications so you guys are notified every time I upload. And thank you guys again for 1K. Like, ugh. like even just talking about it, I feel like my eyes are watering. I'm getting a little emotional. Like, I only imagine. Like, I had my channel for years. I think I've had my channel 
I don't even know how many years I've had my channel but I've had it for a while and it has took a while to get to where I am but I definitely feel like I'm growing and I'm getting better and better and better with each video and I'm really taking my channel seriously so yeah I announced on my Instagram that upload days would be every Sunday so I'm trying to hold myself to that I've been doing my content planner and everything making sure everything is good and copacetic for y'all and yes I will see you guys in the next video bye loves